Okay, we've completed our eight all the way around that center hole, and now we're going to slip stitch it to the top of this uh, stitch right here. We're going to skip these two chains right here and go right to the top. It's kind of hard to see with the white and then the bright light. Let's see if I can change it here. I'm going to go right to the top of that. Get both of those stitches. You're going to want to pull, give it a nice firm tug, and pull that yarn over and pull it through there, and go ahead and pull it through there. And it's going to be nice and tight, and it's going to start to form a curve. Let's see if I can adjust the light at all. There we go. You can kind of see it a little bit better. There we go. So it makes that, it's the beginning of the eye. So then we're going to chain two, as usual. Then you're going to go into that same stitch again, just right there. Pull up a loop and go through two, and then through two. Now we're going to go, we're going to do two in each stitch all the way around. And there was eight, so that was our first one. So now we need to do, go around and do the seven more. So we're going to go around and do that. And do two in each one. It's going to be kind of tight because we want it to be a small little eyeball. Again, pull your yarn out so you're not fighting with it. And you have plenty of yarn so you won't be pulling. It might be kind of hard to see where you have to go, but this is our next stitch right there. So we're going to go right into that, right there. It's going to want to curve on you, but just you are in control of the yarn. Yarn's not going to control of you. Go to the next stitch. And do two in each of these. And go ahead and do a slip stitch to the first one, and we will continue.